Hi guys, welcome to the tutorial. I've been looking, flicking through some like Vogue magazines and looking at some pictures of a recent um, fashion show. I don't know the names, I'm going to be honest with you. And I've been noticing a, a look on a lot of models. It's like a green, gold, purple and black smoky eye. So I'm going to call it a jeweled eye and I'm going to show you how to do that today. So I've already got um, a lick of foundation, blush and a really kind of neutral lip and I've done my eyebrows and that's about it so this is really focusing on the eyes today. Now I'm going to do this whole look using my Karaja eye palette which looks like this. I'm going to make it as easy as possible even though it looks like a really fantastic funky effect. Now if you don't have some good quality eyeshadows don't worry too much. What I would recommend is um, taking your brush and dipping it in some water before using the eyeshadow because that will increase the intensity of the look. So I'm going to start with a quite a small eyeshadow brush and from my Wonder Box 2 I'm using this gold here in the middle. So taking a little bit of that on my brush. You might have some fallout but um, so maybe you'd want to do the eyes before you do the foundation but I'll just clean it up afterwards. And what I'm going to do is pop that into the inner corner of my eye bring it up a bit and slightly underneath the eye. Next step is to take from my Colour Emotion 2 this lovely uh, green colour and using a nice fat eyeshadow brush I'm going to press that over the entire eyelid. only up to the crease. I'm also going to take the very end of that brush with the same green and just run it, uh, meeting up with the gold, run it underneath my eye under that middle section there. Next from my Colour Emotion 2 I'm going to take this black that's got a bit of sparkle in it and using a socket brush like this which is nice and round just a little bit because I'm going to build it up I'm going to take that and make a little V shape to the outer corner of my eye and run it under to meet the green and just keep working that in until you get to the intensity that you want. So that it's more smoky and not so harsh I've just taken a clean eyeshadow brush and I just keep blending it. Now the last step for the eyeshadows is to take a really vivid purple so I've got one from my Wonderbox one down here and I've got an angled eyeshadow brush I'm going to take a little bit of that and join it all up together. So I'm going to go over the gold and reach it up to the black. It's just going to fill in that small pocket of space. And again, keep adding until you get the intensity that you want. Now in the Vogue or in the fashion shows that I looked at, the purple is really tense. It kind of goes up like a square to the eyebrow and, and squares out but I've just made it more round to make it a bit more feminine. It is an intense look but you can um, you can really make it as intense as you want it to be. Just put the colours on more lightly or make them finer and you can do the same thing with any principle like I could have used this colour emotion too and just use those four colours so the black, green, aqua blue and a kind of silver gold there just making keeping the principle that you start with the lightest and move out to the darkest now I have these beautiful three uh, metallic glitter pens here one is a glitter chick one it's a gold from Karaja um, this is a glitter green three and I've also got a glitter black number two and you could line the inner rim of your eye with any of these but what I think I'm going to do is take the green and go along the top of my eye for a bit more intensity and maybe line the inner with the black but I reckon you, it could be beautiful with any of it so let's see how that looks. So taking the green and I'm going to run that all along the top of my lash line and taking the black and I'm going to put that on my waterline. So 
So the black is really more sultry, but if you wanted to make it fresher, I'd say use the gold. That would be just as beautiful. So I'm just going to finish off that look by curling my eyelashes. And adding some of my Lash Lift Express black mascara. I think adding those glitter pencils have made, has made it a really jeweled effect. So I am going to call this the jeweled eyeshadow effect. And there you go. There it is. Pretty easy. A few simple steps. I think that would look lovely on a Friday night out. Enjoy your day. Thanks so much for watching.